Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forum weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation of the currency markets and should help you to stay on top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome everybody guys, let's take a look again on the forex market. As you can see on the euro currency is nothing to talk about, this market stands flat. Um, some between the butterfly targets and um, just tells us that, well, it probably should reach the 1618 extension of the butterfly in the short term, just gradually moving to it. So that's why today we decided to take a look at the Australian dollar. So because here we have the long playing scenario. So we start talking about this even uh, last year. As we said that we prepared for forming on the hand shoulders patch in year, um, or even its failure. So which also brings a lot of background for a trading. And actually, as you could see, currently the reverse hand shoulders patterns is forming in many currencies: Great British Pound, New Zealand Dollar, Australian Dollar. So, uh, and uh, here is almost everywhere the price is coming to decisive point actually the bottom of the right arm where we should get the clarity either upper direction forming the upside ABCD significant action to the upside or failure and drop below the recent lows so particularly for Australian dollar it probably will mean the action somewhere to uh, if it will work properly in an area of 95 96 in the case of the failure, it's dropped below the 50. So market will take it out of this low somewhere to the 50 cents per dollar. So that's why this is a really big pattern on the monthly chart. That's why it really seems important. So uh, on the weekly chart, that's just to show you the shape of the pattern that we are talking about. This grabber is not interesting right now, it's just because it already has been completed. And the thing that we discussed last time, when we talked about this monthly chart so currently is most interesting what we have on the weekly and the daily chart on the weekly you could see that market is almost completed the ABCD pattern to the downside and this target perfectly agrees with the bottom of the left arm and here is local spike down as you can see it also stands very close to it so that's approximately the range somewhere around 67 67 68 probably with these targets we have the ABCD target around 67.30, but if you use as the A point this one, it will be slightly lower, around 66. So that's an area that we intend to keep an eye on. The, the only uh, problem here uh, that uh, well, stands actually not in favor of the bullish pattern, although in general performance here looks better than on that. Great British Pound. So you can see on the monthly chart of the Great British Pound, we see just acceleration down, which put the big shadow on perspective of the pattern there. Besides, it is um, flat pattern on the on Great British Pound. The bottoms here, shoulder stands too deep. It's even not 27. Here's more or less acceptable shape, but we have the acceleration. This is not really very good. At the same time, uh, hand shoulders suggest that although it is better if we have the harmony between the bottoms, but 618 level usually treats as a acceptable for a possible downward action. It means that even if even we have a bit deeper downside action, well, it will be a bit more complicated to deal with this pattern uh, because we will have to search another patterns on the lower time frame on the daily to justify a possible entry trying to catch the moment for taking the position, watching for patterns and so on. But still, it will be in general possible. But right now, we're watching for this one, and theoretically, the market also has chances to, well, either fail or start to work with this pattern. And uh, here, we're watching for these patterns. So first of all, we have the minor butterfly. As you can see, that's uh, 127 extension agrees with the 67 area. 1618.65.48 and if market comes to the 61, 1618 uh, it will be sufficient to uh, 
agree with the a b c d pattern even with this a points so if the we take the major top here right from there and right there so it will be 6690 so as you can see uh, this target will be enough so market completes simultaneously the weekly ABCD completes the part of Y so that's an area that we intend to keep an eye on there's also here some kind of edge of consolidation and ABCD patient there now it stands at the COP and uh, OP stands 64.50 even lower and it's probably somewhere close to the right major 618 support so this is approximately the situation that we have uh, on Australian dollar country. We are not considering taking any positions because actually market stands too close to the target. You could try, of course, on the intraday charts, searching channels to go short. Uh, well, but in general, uh, for, uh, we're interesting mostly with this uh, longer term charts, longer term patterns, because it, it has the great potential. And uh, here is the potential for reaching of the a 127 target stands too small and so it's not very interesting so that's what we have currently on australian dollar it seems that within the maybe nearest month we could get some multiple uh, trading stops here on aussie dollar 